you guys I have HelloFresh here. HelloFresh has honestly been here two days and I'm just now telling you guys about it. If you haven't heard any noise in the background, you know it's my laundry. But I have a HelloFresh review. I am not sponsored or they didn't ask me nor pay me. I'm just trying this out because I'm trying to find a easier, healthier way for me and my boyfriend to eat and my son, of course. Um, and I'm just trying to find a, a simple way to cook during the week after work, something easy um, and something that is not a lot of carbs, you guys. So anyways let's get into it i know you guys are used to the big old green box opening and all that stuff but girl sis bruh when i got the box it was soaking wet the food the ice product it had they had just texted me and told me that they had dropped it off at my house sis not even five minutes later it was melting now i'm from dallas texas and the weather was not at all hot that day it was very cool it was very chilly and there was no sun out so it was cloudy out there and when I came to the house to pick up the box so I could put the stuff in the fridge the ice packs were totally melted and my box was very destroyed so upon picking the box up all my stuff fell out the box um, I know some people have like insulation in their box my box was just like normal box I don't know what the problem is with HelloFresh but that box was horrible so I intend to complain about that because for the price that they're charging me which I had a coupon code which was supposed to give me 20 um, a hundred and some dollars off so they break it down into six easy payments so my first payment was for all this stuff was $29.99 um, up on looking at my bank statement which you guys need to be looking at because HelloFresh is doing some sneaky sneaky digga dings here okay they charged me $61 for this stuff. It says $29. They said at first they charged me $29. Then I look at my bank statement. It said $61. So I'm looking, I'm like confused myself. So they said that because I ordered an extra um, meal item. I was only supposed to order three. But this is supposed to be like an extra meal item. So life lessons you live and you learn i went ahead and paid that 61 dollars sis because yes that in order that was my fault they broke it down to me but i just feel like it's a whole gimmick i could go to the store you guys and buy the same stuff and come out cheaper and for my little mom hack out there you can go on pinterest.com i am a pinterest i i have a pinterest addiction i'm a pole pinterest mom um, and you can find me at it's Andrea Michelle sis on Pinterest um, but um, and you're more than welcome to follow me on there if you want to um, but I found a whole lot of HelloFresh recipes that I could incorporate and make my own um, but I am just trying this out and I'm going to stick with it um, until the very end because I signed up for it so I'm going to take responsibility for it but it just kind of turned me off with that box and that ice pack and I like the whole fact though that you can recycle everything so I recycle everything in the recycle bin in my apartments but I initially ordered a meal box for for three to four people and I don't see how you can feed three to four people with one thing of a ground beef or one thing of chicken or one thing of, of steak sirloin steak uh, I just don't get it and tonight I'm having we're having this chicken meal and it's just that chicken right there that I have unthrall because I have to hurry up and put everything in the freezer but let me go ahead and tell you guys what we have it tonight um, and the cool facts is that they come with their own little recipes here so we have crispy parmesan chicken which we're having tonight uh, i want to try that and then also we have i can't wait to try this one too brown sugar bourbon chicken anything brown sugar bourbon i love like this looks so good but i don't really have time to cook it tonight um then we have in this steak and sure um sherry charlotte sauce um so and it tells you like what you're supposed to have in the box and all that stuff and how to cook it because the recipe basically shows you what to do on the back. 
um, and then um, it tells you like your calories and stuff like that so that's good and then we have our melted Monterey Jack burgers and what else did I show you guys yeah I think I've showed you all four and these are the bags and it has everything in it I'm not gonna open them until I cook them for you each night so this is the melty Monterey Jack burger and it comes with its own ground beef. I would prefer ground turkey but when I was pressing the ground turkey it would not let me um, substitute that ground beef for uh, the ground turkey. So I just went ahead and got this ground beef. I'll probably stop at Target's and get me some ground turkey um, so I can have a turkey burger and babe will eat this because he loves ground beef. Then for the steak it comes with its own little steak. For all these products, make sure you wash every vegetable, every fruit, and every meat down. <laughs> um, and then for um, the brown sugar bourbon, it has like its own little thing stuff in there. And then tonight we're just having crispy parmesan chicken, which I just have the chicken. Um, it thaws out. That's the good thing about it. You can just put it in some water and it thaws out for you really quick. Um, and then inside my box... Um, they say that you get like a free item so I did get a free item which came beat up <laughs> uh, which is the Taco Fiesta Bush Best Sidekicks these are I guess new beans that they have and then um, they did send a coupon which I think I put in this little envelope that came with it so um, I'm going to use that coupon no doubt um, so it says buy one can of Bush Sidekicks get one free so that's really really good um, and it says hello fresh gift so that's my gift and then it comes with this pack say hello to special offers from our partners and it has like all these little um, partner deals in here and so you got and I got some Shutterfly um, stuff 50% off on Shutterfly which they have for uh, pictures, towels, um, you can add your pictures to towels, um, posters, um, like all anything crafty like your bags and stuff like that, reusable bags, you can add your pictures to that, coffee mugs, <laughs> they have all kinds of sort of stuff. So I did get a bark box and I'm going to leave that code for anyone that has a beautiful, loving paw friend. Um, I don't know if it has like an... Oh, it says scan the code. So, whoever scans this code, I guess go ahead and um, use that code for your paw friend. I don't know if you can do it like off of my camera or through the video, but that's the scanner code. And then um, I got some Harry's um, shaving kit if you're a man or woman, and they have a nice little um, get your trial set free I guess and that's the code for it so you just scan it and it's like a $13 value um, and then what else I think it's something else in there oh I'm gonna use this myself and this is a wine voucher for a hundred dollars special gift for you $100 wine voucher I'm gonna use that because um, this is for naked wines dot com I'm gonna research that up and um, see about that um, because I am a wine drinker and I love 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 like crisp fresh fruity type of wine but like I said tonight we're gonna have this crispy parmesan chicken um, and I'm just trying to move everything so for the couscous because I've never tried couscous I'm gonna try it tonight um, but I know my boyfriend is not gonna eat no couscous because he is not a, cou cou a couscous type of person so I'm gonna have the couscous um, and then I'll save some for work tomorrow because I know it's gonna be a little bit left and then I'm gonna make babe some uh, Ben's original ready rice jasmine rice um, inside the rice I mean inside my couscous I'm gonna add some vegetable broth and water um, to give it like a uh, you know a little flavor and then for my flavors I'm going to add some Cajun seasoning for my chicken and 365 Whole Foods Market avocado oil that's what we've been using um, so we're making like drastic changes I'm gonna use my measure um, so with this meal it comes with 
carrots, scallions, garlic, lemon, panko breadcrumbs, um, parmesan cheese, hot smoked paprika, um, chicken cutlets, sour cream, um, and Israeli uh, couscous. So I'm ready to make this meal. If you're ready to make it with me, then um, come and join me. And if you made it this far, please go ahead and subscribe to the channel. And in advance, thank you for your support because it is definitely, definitely welcomed. And I very much appreciate y'all supporting my channel. So don't forget to thumbs up and also click that notification bell because I need you guys to know that when I post stuff look don't miss out because I always have some good stuff going around so today is just like probably like a vlog kind of day because y'all seen my whole bath and my whole hygiene routine me doing laundry and we're about to cook so yes yeah, sis I, I'm getting it in and that's what we're gonna do let's get to it so really quick I just added a half a cup of water and just a half a cup of the vegetable oil I mean not the vegetable oil but my vegetable stock and then I got the avocado oil in the pan already melted down and then I have some more avocado oil in this pan because um, I'm gonna saute the carrots instead of putting them inside of the oven I don't know what vegetable bag is gonna eat because he does not like saute carrots at all so um, Let's check and see what's really in this bag. It says, "Hi, together we're helping millions of families in need. They need to put food on the table." So I love that part that HelloFresh is helping other families, and you can honestly recycle this bag too as well. Um, and it has like little that you know fun facts. So let's check and see what's in this bag. We have oh, um, we have some couscous. For three to four people, I just don't get it. Like, what did I order here? Because <laughs> it don't look like it's a lot. But I have some couscous here. Breadcrumbs. Shallots. Onions. Um, a lemon. Some parmesan. Um, a bag of carrots which is pretty by the way my bag is really pretty um the what is that smoked paprika okay I don't like this part right here the garlic was just like sitting out not even a package like <laughs> and then some sour cream a little pack of sour cream y'all like for three to four people I'm not understanding that and that is it that's all I see in the bag you guys so um, that was all that was in the bag so let's get to cooking so it just says to chop up all your stuff so that when you're getting ready to cook you'll have everything on hand and it'll be easy and simple for you to um, grab and put in food so I did the same thing um, I have the green onion the white onion I'm gonna use my garlic instead of that other garlic because it wasn't wrapped um, and then I have the carrots sliced for myself because baby's not gonna eat carrots and my son is not a big carry fan either a little bit of lemon zest because I don't think I will want a lot of bitter in my food and then the four cut lemons so I'm just gonna uh, start doing stuff step by steps um, so you can see what I'm doing so basically I just did the prepping and so next I'm gonna do coating the chicken and then so on so on <laughs> so on just following the steps how they have it now these this is like a weekly night pan meal but I'm gonna sear um, put mine on the stove and do mine that way because I think it's like really quicker to put it on the stove also um, if you need a quick trash can and you don't want to mess up your original trash can um, use the recycle bag that HelloFresh gave you for a trash bag um, and I just put all those um, you know 
um, strands of carrots and stuff inside of there and I'm gonna put the bags and then I'll just dispose of it so yeah so this is the chicken I breaded it and seasoned it so it calls for you to put the sour cream on the chicken and I just I don't know about that I just felt kind of weird doing that so I went ahead and did what I knew best and I mixed some egg with my Louisiana uh, Cajun seasoned salt um, and I uh, mix the panko I use honestly I use my panko crumbs with their panko crumbs and then I added a little bit of more Parmesan cheese um, whatever you like to do do it because this is just a meal kit and you can fix it up razzle dazzle it however you like to razzle dazzle it and put whatever seasonings because it really didn't have that much seasoning I did not add the um, I add the seasoning on the Louisiana um, seasoning on to the chicken and let it marinate for just a little bit. Then I added the panko, the parmesan, and the uh, avocado oil, and what else? Did I add? Oh, the smoked paprika into a bowl of its own and mix it all up. Um, and then um, add it to the chicken. Now, like I said, you can do a. Um, you can do this in the oven, but I'm going to do it on top of the stove. So I got my oil and stuff already heated. It said that you can use butter, um, but I wanted to use my avocado oil. So I'm going to go ahead and put this on the stove, hoping that this oil is nice and, there we go, so nice and heated. And then I'm just gonna put the chicken on there and let it simmer, saute. I've been washing everything, so clean as you go. It'll be an easier process. Um, and so next we're gonna do um, saute our carrots and all that good stuff. I'm probably gonna already have it on the stove. I just feel like it's gonna be a waste of time just chopping and you know putting stuff together. When I can just do it step by step as it is on the um, the recipe card. So yeah. So like I said, it's my first time ever having couscous. And I'm really excited to have it. To try it. Who knows, I may love it. <laughs> um, but I'm just confused on how it's supposed to look. It's supposed to look like that or... So I got my carrots pretty much sauteing under there. I like my carrots not too done done. I still love that extra crunch. And this is the chicken. I just have a top over it so it can thoroughly cook through. These are still the staples that I have left, which is the garlic, the white onion, our shallot, and the green shallot and some lemon. I did add some lemon juice to this. I added some honey because I like my carrots a little sweet. And then I added some of my Louisiana Cajun seasoning. In here I just added olive oil, the vegetable stock, and a half a cup of water. I'm thinking that this is done so I'm gonna go ahead and get this off and drain. And I'll be back once I plate up everything.